What do you do if you are a business that sells products incredibly infrequently? For example, let's say you sell mattresses. How often does someone buy a mattress? It could be years between each purchase. My answer to this question is that you have to spend the time online to stay top of mind to your potential buyers. So, for example, what I do as a Facebook advertiser, people hire Facebook advertisers very infrequently. It could be that they hire one throughout the entire period of a business. And even if they are switching between one and another Facebook advertiser, it could be months or years before they hire their next advertiser. So what I do, what I spend my time doing is making sure that I stay top of mind to my relevant audiences by creating videos like this one. Another thing that I suggest doing to stay top of mind is create a referral program that incentivizes those people that know who you are to talk more about your product. For example, what would get other people to talk about me? Well, if I had a program that said, if you sent me a client, I will pay you money. If it's a good fit between me and the client, I am happy to give you a referral fee because I know that that will make me be the top of mind person for your Facebook ads. And that same thing is true for any business that sells things infrequently. If you have something and you want others to be thinking about you, you need to give them a reason to think about you. And to do that, you have to give them some incentive that makes, them, makes it worthwhile for them to think about you. The last thing that you should think about is to make sure that when it is the season for people to be buying. For example, here in Rampe Chemesh, it is very common for most buyers of, of houses to buy in June, July, and August. So if you know that your buyers buy in that period of time, June, July, August, you should spend the time making sure that you are getting out during those periods. So those are my three tips. Number one, stay top of mind by simply always posting and creating consistency in your business, getting your message out. Number two, create a referral program that makes sure that people know who you are and give you a reason, give them a reason to talk about you. And number three, find out if there's a specific season when people are buying your product and make sure to go extra hard during those periods to keep everyone thinking about you and not your competitor.